What's up YouTube? We're back here on the kitchen table and I've got something new that's a little bit old to show y'all today. Uh, QSC Series 1 Model 1400 Pro Audio Amplifier that I recently picked up off eBay for a pretty good price and just wanted to give you all a little overview of the amplifier and talk about it a little, turn it on and play a little music with it. Um, first thing about these amps this is actually the second one of these amps I purchased they're built like a tank it's extremely heavy I think it's 43 44 pounds something like that just you don't see this kind of construction anything made today um, overall the condition of the amplifier itself was pretty good has some of these stickers on it I'm not sure uh, what kind of identification they were doing with these stickers um, it looks like the amp wherever it was was permanently wired because the terminals are a little bit loosened when it showed up for those connections and go ahead I've already taken the screws out and everything inside of the amplifier massive transformer big filter caps ton of output devices they're all matched All the dates in this amplifier are from, let's see, 24th week of 95, 22nd week of 95, 20th week of 95 on the transformer, so it's a mid-1995 amplifier. The fan in this amp was the only thing that was a little bit stuck when I first got it, but uh, just fiddled around with it a little and uh, it started working. It still seems like it takes off a little bit slow, but... I think both of my uh, 1400 amps are candidates for having a new fan put in but overall just a really nice amp nice sounding well constructed um, this one in particular is just mint both the channels track evenly uh, one thing I really like about these amps the noise floor of the amp itself is really low it does have a little bit of noise from the transformer and the fan but the noise floor on these amps is better than my newer Onkyo stereo receiver it's only a couple years old so I've been pretty impressed with these amps so far they're very powerful and uh, we'll go ahead and uh, crank it up give it a little listening test here I've got uh, the Mackie mixer from my main rig my uh, Marty McFly rig I guess you call it on the kitchen table uh, here's the music we're gonna be using just some hopefully won't get the audio muted since it's on YouTube already just some big trance techno playlist kinda test the speakers out on my old Mac computer and I kinda use for this purpose and running RCA's into the mixer and XLR to quarter inch TRS jacks into the mixer and uh, enough talk let's uh, turn it on and see how she sounds not sure how loud I just got this camera and I'm still uh, getting used to using it I don't know how good the microphone is on it so uh, hopefully this isn't all distorted in person it sounds very clean
but overall I gotta say this amp really does rock those little speakers and it's a great amp and uh, I didn't show y'all give y'all a quick look at the back of the amplifier got some uh, pretty nice binding posts for the speaker terminals and over here we have quarter inch and XLR in and two gain controls one for each channel and a terminal strip if you're going to hardwire the amp which I think the previous users had it set up that way and these two things here the octal sockets which were designed I believe to be used with other uh, accessories that QSC made at the time like crossovers and things like that but uh, overall a pretty basic amp but oh, accidentally hit the zoom there like I said still getting used to this camera but thing overall is very nice you just do not see things built like this anymore apparently QSC at some point they were doing quality control by throwing their amplifiers off the roof of their warehouse to see how well they fared so I gotta say um, I've been happy with my crown amps but future purchases of pro audio amps uh, QSC may end up getting the bid But anyways, this video is starting to go on a little long, so we'll shut it down and probably be back on the kitchen table again here soon with another amp or set of speakers or who knows.